Welcome back, YouTube. So we're going to carry on with this Let's Play episode. This is episode two. <sighs> the last episode, we uh, we just got our horse. Um, we explored uh, the Groveside Cavern. And now we are going to pick up where we left off. Before I go on here, though, I do want to go back to the church and see if there's any new items I can buy from the merchant. If maybe he has more dialogue. Oh, and look at that. We uh we got someone else to talk to now. A pleasure to meet thee, Tarnished. I am the witch Rena. I'd heard tell of a tarnished hurtling about atop a spectral steed. And upon looking into the matter, the talk I surmise is of thee. Thou art possessed of the power, no? To call forth a spectral steed named Torrent. I can call the spectral steed. As I had hoped, I was entrusted this for thee by Torrent's former master. Spirit calling bell and lone wolf ashes. It is a bell of calling forth spirits. Summon them with it. From ash and return to the earth tree, the spirits will obey thine command but briefly. As they recall battles past, now it is thine. To do it as thou wishest. With the spirit calling bell, you can use ashes to summon various spirits. Summoning typically consumes FP. You can only summon one type of spirit at a time, and you cannot summon spirits during multiplayer. Okay. So does that mean I should be able to summon my fanged imp ashes, which is the the thing I chose when I made my character? Not sure if that was a good choice, but that's what I I doubt we shall again meet chose. But all the same. Learn well the lands between. How long will it be, I wonder, before the tarnished tire of obeisance to the two fingers? And she just disappeared. Alright, let's see what this guy's got. Weren't you? Well, you're back. Care to buy something? Let's talk. There are others of my people who yet survive in these lands. If the mood takes you and you meet one, then offer them some praise, won't you? My people, wanderers all have long been spurned by the grace of gold, which is why we cannot settle. But instead are forced into this pitiful, unceasing journey. But thanks to that, things are not so different for us now. Though the Elden Ring is shattered, I think this makes us kindred spirits of sorts. Your people, the Tarnished, and mine. Perhaps you don't need to hear this, but see that no harm comes to my kin. We have a saying. We wanderers, lament not your solitude. Expect no sympathy, no regard, nothing. But if anyone dares harm us, show them no mercy. That is our code, so to speak. Just the way we are, deeply unforgiving. All right, so I wonder if that means if you attack one merchant, they all become hostile to you. And I think I'm gonna buy the cookbook one. Let's see if that gives me. It didn't really give me anything new, but that's okay. With the smithing menu, you can spend runes and smithing stones. You can strengthen your armaments up to plus three at a table. And we'll have to find a blacksmith to make them go up higher after that. Although I don't think I'm going to be sticking with the long sword for long. I just want to uh, use it till I find something better. Alright, let's go back up here to the gate front, Grace. And let's <coughs> explore these ruins that we haven't explored yet. Right behind us. Wow. 
anything up on here. Lord Sorn's great sword. Choir 16 strength, 10 dexterity. Let's see if I can see what the weapon art is. Okay, so a big uppercut. I don't even remember picking up a halberd, but let's give that a try. Charges fourth, strength fourteen, dex twelve. Let's use that. Okay, so your standard is a poke. Heavy is a swing. Poke. Spin. Okay. Seems like this might be a a good choice for now. What's this? Map Limgrave West. We'll check out what that unlocked here in just a moment once we're done fighting. Aggressive. this guy gotcha oh and I have no flasks perfect anyways real quick a new map has been found Limgrave West oh nice now we can see some of the map and the terrain and the roads. That's pretty cool. I'm wondering how big this game actually is. I've I've read and heard that it's a pretty big game, but reading and hearing and all that is completely different than experiencing it for yourself. I'm actually just going to go ahead and rest at the grace just to get my flasks back. And we'll continue exploring this area. And if you can't tell, I am by no means necessary a pro. I am a somewhat of a Souls veteran. I've played almost all of the Souls games. over this way I do have to say jumping adds a whole new aspect to the gameplay so that's glowing 
Okay, golden rune one. It's gonna give us some runes. Herba. Another crafting mat. and the entire game has something in them. Pick up item, a flail. Ten strength, eighteen dexterity. Spinning chain. Causes blood loss buildup. Might be something worth looking into. I don't have the stats to use it, but All right, there's the angry dude of the area. Let's check out this side of the ruins. See if there's any missed items. And is that a cave? Strong foe ahead. <laughs> People and their messages. What do I get here? What's Ash of War. With a whetstone knife, you can ash use Ashes of War to grant affinities to your armaments at Sites of Grace. This way, you can alter an armament's attack affinity, boost attribute scaling, and more. An armament's type determines what affinities it can have. Some special armaments, like those with unique skills, cannot be granted new affinities. Ash of War, Storm Stomp, and a whetstone knife to allow me to change the Ashes of War. It's pretty cool. <clears throat> it's definitely something that someone who doesn't explore could easily miss out on. Let's see. Is there anything else in this area? Not sure if I've explored it all or not. There's the angry man. Oh, yeah. Another herb, uh, a sleeping soldier. And smoldering butterflies. There's another guy right here. Let's see if I can sneak up on him. item. <coughs> oh, 
and now I'm getting attacked by everything. I don't like this. Soldier now, now it's just these stupid bats. Holy cow. These guys are not cool. What? And that's me dead. fucking runes back wherever they may be guess that symbol on the mini map is my runes although I'm not seeing the bats this time do they only spawn at night hmm anyways <coughs> I think we explored that area Let's uh let's keep on exploring. Let's see. So we go what is this? bird's eye telescope. You can use the bird's eye telescopes found in various areas to get a bird's eye view of how a terrain in the direction of that telescope is facing. Okay, yes. From what I can see just from this telescope, this place looks massive. So that must be me like right down below me we got the big lake that's the the church and that's where we started so we are gonna continue down that way okay we'll make a couple of waypoints of places I want to check out I definitely want to check whatever this circle thing is. And these look like maybe they could be some ruins. Let's check those out. Ow. Oh, that's pretty cool. Getting used to the horse riding is kind of hard. With the combat, anyways. What do you got? Row of fruit. Um, and it looks like. What is this thing? Oh, there's another guy on a horse.
Oh my god. <laughs> that did not go as expected. <sighs> I'll just go back to the last side of Grace. <clears throat> and I think as far as exploring goes, I'm just going to continue to explore and I'm going to kind of pass up all these enemies on the bridge right now. Can always come back and kill them. I do want to see what this thing is, though. Ash of War Determination. So those things drop random stuff, I guess? Alright, we're gonna follow this road. And... It looks like two giants pulling a cart. With a lot of enemies behind them, we are gonna <laughs> avoid that for the moment. Waypoint ruins. Oh. Let's uh, let's try out my summit. These little guys are doing some damage. Immuni immunizing cured meat. Miranda powder. You guys are beefy. Let's see, what else we got out here? in this area. What's back here? So far, a whole lot of nothing. What's over this? Nothing. Nothing. This is where the big flower was. Golden rune. And I wasn't even paying attention to my health, but I died. Because I'm an awesome player. I don't pay attention to nothing. Stake America. Okay, let's uh... Let's get in these ruins and pull these guys out again. Because they seem like they do some pretty good damage. There's my ruins.
Ow. That was not cool. Trying to figure out. Oh. Looks like there's another cave down here. Let's go ahead and heal up. And probably gonna summon these guys again. just hit him with took away half his health. And got him. These little things. <laughs> Brutal. Cool. Alright, and I got a gray sight in here now. Rest. And uh, we're going to open up this door. Okay, doesn't look like an enemy. Tarnished, are we? I wonder you should turn up here. I am Salem, a sorcerer, quite plainly. Why are you here? Um. Yen for glimstone sorcery. I dare say your proclivities are far from ideal. Oh well, perhaps nurture will defy nature. But one must choose one's masters wisely. I was exiled from the Academy of Rea Lucaria. As a reviled, a you still wish to learn. I still want to learn. <laughs> well, very well. You are now my but I refuse to coddle. Or cast anticipate grievances. Study sorcery. So glenstone, pebble, stars, arc, crystal barrage, scholar's armament, and scholar's shield. Okay, so this is going to be, from the sounds of it, one of the sorcery vendors. Not in thought. Alright. Anyways, back to what we were doing and exploring. here and let's continue towards my waypoints all right we're gonna go to one first No, thank you. This must be one of them stakes. What are these things? Are they going to attack me? Doesn't look like they're hostile and they drop ruin fragments. Forlorn Hound River Jail. Examine. Uh, yeah, let's enter it. Let's see what happens. Okay, and we get a 
house apparently. button wrong time oh he just tore me up didn't even get a single hit on him we're gonna try this again and take him out a sword he's got looks pretty cool I wonder if we can get it as a drop Some reason I can't summon the things in here. Ow. This guy's attacks are quick, I gotta learn them. starting to get the hang of this guy we'll get him I want that sword Oh, man. Oh, bad timing. Very bad timing. Guys, attacks are deadly. I'll give it one more try and then we'll move on and come back. There's almost no point in even using a shield. It seems like his bleed just goes right through it. Maybe I can get lucky and stagger him.
Oh, mid-air hit. Damn. We will come back very shortly to this guy. Uh, but I want my runes. Hopefully they're dropped outside. Oh, wrong button. I guess I gotta run back up there and get my runes real quick. Okay. And where was that? this way, right? Yeah. No, sir. Outside, yes, cool. All right, now is there anything to explore behind this place? Looks like it may be a different zone. Let's go to this other waypoint I made real quick and check it out. See if there's anything up there. Great dragonfly head. that up. Jumping while on a horseback near a spirit spring to ride its current high into the air. You won't take damage from jumping into a spirit string. Okay. So... Whoa! That's pretty cool. Where's my wave? Royal House Scroll. Give to a learned sorcerer to acquire a new sorcerer. Okay, so turn that in, unlocks more sorceries. like it could be a cave whoa that guy is mad Grace. This place seems like it is littered with sights of grace. Let's go ahead and level up. Let's uh throw some more into string. Let's get them both to sixteen. Try to keep them even. Work towards a quality build. Giant crabs. Those are always fun. Okay, 
so we have some ruins down here. Let's check these out. Dragon burnt ruins. There's a cave here. That's pretty cool. Golden Rune 2. <coughs> Followed by a backstab. Train as Lily. And a Ruin Fragment. Alright, let's be wary of pack. Rats. Always fun. And I guess because I killed all of them, I got a flask back. Cool. Wicker sword ahead. Trap ahead. Open. Snared in a transporter trap. Salia Crystal Tunnel. Gravity Stone Fan, Gravity Stone Chunk. Um, that took me pretty far away. And I do no damage to these things. So, we are going to try to get out of here. What are you shooting at me? Found a grace. What was this? Rock grease. Hmm. 
Hmm. Where am I? Okie dokie. Well, this is probably not where we should be at this level. Um, and on that note, I think we're going to end the video here. And we'll pick off. We'll pick up where we left off. And uh, we will get back to the Limgrave area and uh, try to explore a little bit more of that. Anyways, hope you guys have a good one. And we'll see you in the next one.